Hi everyone. I look for a lot of different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, we have been showing for many years now that we're nearing the end times of the Bible, and it has a lot to do with Obama and Donald Trump and all the way to the Pope and with Russia and Angela Merkel, Merkel and the Pope and the Russian Orthodox Church, a many-headed beast, and Donald Trump with the golden calf judgment coming. See the golden calf which was the same as during the exodus. Well right in front of us we have everything that we've been showing for many years. We don't know a date when this will happen. But you can see here white nationalists with torches march on campus. We have said before that the Illuminati and Freemasons want a race war. They want one. Obama is ready to return. Do you see this same picture right in front of us? White nationalists with torches march on campus. Trump touts tourism and bizarre phone call. And now Obama is returning this fall. The fall. And Trump isn't going to like it. We have shown this before that he is coming back. And that is when this tower will come down. And the exodus will begin with the golden calf until the new age. War, World War Three, all of these guys are coming. All of them. May God have mercy on us all. So there we go, just like we've been sh showing. Obama's ready to return. Something's going to happen with Donald Trump and with the USA. And Obama is going to rise back up. It's actually on this ancient glyph called the Dendera chart. It represents the wheel of the Great Tribulation. See how it's a big wheel? You have to remember that from Abraham to Jesus went to Egypt. Moses went to Egypt. Moses was brought out from underneath the burdens of Egypt. All of these come back to the end times. If you look right about here, you will begin to see Obama's eye and his mouth. If not, realize he is Pharaoh. We have to escape from under him. See there? There he is. This is the sword for World War III. This is Jesus Christ right here, casting down the accuser, and this is the woman of the Bible with the arrow for the first horseman. See how the arrow is aimed right at the star for us to cross over, and this is an ark. This ark launches, and we pass over him. See the eagle, and now here is Donald Trump. And Donald Trump has a nuclear event planned. And when this nuclear event happens, see it pushes on the bull, and it kicks the mask off of Obama. And Obama is revealed as the man of perdition, and he rises back up. Yes, during a great big terribleness coming. It's even mapped out in many videos. Let's show. This shows Obama getting ready to start something. This Molotov cocktail. See him with the Molotov cocktail? No church in the wild. Now they are starting an event. See, they have the BLM going against the police. See? That's the key to open the abyss. And now fire. Now there's fighting everywhere. Civil War, World War, everything breaks out. The police state starts. Here comes the horsemen, and it goes all the way down to the end that Donald Trump builds a wall. See the wall of the police? He has his wall. And everybody that is locked outside is locked out in utter darkness. 
and then they are made to worship the image of the beast. See the big golden calf elephant? And now they are all worshiping the image of the beast. It's all going according to plan. Here comes Obama. Here comes the Civil War and World War III. They have North Korea, China, Russia all ready. The whole world is ready for a great big spark to go off. For the tower to come down. And the golden calf to go on. Until the new Israel and Jerusalem and the new branch. And Jesus Christ takes over. So you can see it all right there. There is Donald Trump. There's going to be a nuclear event. Things are going to fall apart and Obama is going to rise back up as the man of perdition. There's the eagle granted to the woman when a great earthquake even happens. So let's keep faith and that's the sword for World War III. We are supposed to pass over him just like that. There we go. Here they come. That doesn't mean it will happen today. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. In Scripture we're nearing this. The Revelation 13 beast out of the sea, and then the beast out of the earth, and the mark of the beast. Right in front of us. Trump. Here we go. Everybody pray for peace. I'll see all of you at the wedding feast of the Lamb. Hallelujah. Obama will be returning after the fall. The fall of Babylon coming. God have mercy. This is actually a secret too. And Trump isn't going to like it. Do you see it? See this movie called It Coming? Time to drag the kids all down into the sewer. Down into the pit. See it? It's in Zechariah 5. Right here. The flying scroll. Many people think that's a nuke. Or a UFO even. I will bring it forth, saith the Lord of hosts. And it shall enter into the house of the thief and in the house of him that sweareth falsely by my name. It is a curse. This is a curse that goeth forth over the face of the whole earth. You see that right there? A curse is coming. It is a curse. We have to get all the way to the end to get past it, to get to the river of life. And there shall be no more curse, but the throne of God and the Lamb shall be in it. See there? We have to get all the way to the end. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. I'll see all of you at the wedding feast. God have mercy on us all.